everybody, I'm in the Littlewood, also known as Martin, and welcome back to Memory Lane today. I'm surprised I haven't done this a lot sooner. We are playing a game from the Sega Mega Drive. It's what it was called in Europe and, you know, the UK and stuff. Apparently in America, it's called the Sega Genesis, and today I am playing a game called James Pond 2, Codename Robocod. Now, I was going to play Streets of Rage, Sonic 2, you know, stuff like that, but I think a lot of people know of those games. Uh, I don't think many people know of this game, though. <laughs> it's, it's a very different one. It's from Millennium Interactive. They're the guys that developed this game. And it was actually published by EA, which is kind of interesting. Back when they used to make good games. Eh? Eh? But yeah, anyway. So, uh, yeah, this is from EA. In 1991, this came out. So I would have been one at the time. And this guy here is Robocod. And I've just paused it by accident. There we go. <laughs> so you've probably seen the bottom left corner. He's got his fingers up. I think I've got three lives. And I can take three hits on each life or something like that. But you can collect more of those little green things, whatever they are. Um, and this is definitely one of the more bizarre games that I've ever owned in my lifetime. You can actually stretch infinitely as well to the top of the level, so I'm just going to see how far it goes. It does it does have a peak. It does have a top. Let's have a look. Keep going. There we go. <laughs> awesome. I love this game so much. Now, if you've ever played this game before, you might have noticed that there's always five items here. But the thing that you should do, if you ever want to cheat on this game, if you spell out the word cheat with the first letter of each of these things, you'll actually get, um, like, invincibility for, like, half an hour, ten minutes, something like that. And you also get access to any level that you want to go into. So the way you do it is, you do C for, a uh, cake for C, a hammer for H, uh, I might have to hop up there and get the hammer, hold up, there we go, uh, there you go, you get E for the earth, and then you'll get the A for apple, and you'll get the T for tap. And then you'll become invincible. Obviously, I'm not going to do it because I want to show you the game properly. But um, but yeah, if you've, ever, if you've ever played this game, that's exactly what you can do. I'm going to go into the first level. So essentially, the plot line for this is you've defeated Doctor Maybe in the first one. And this time around, he's trying to ruin Christmas. So he's taken over Santa's Grotto. He's taken all of the either elves or apparently, I've just read this, in the European or the British version like I have and like I've got right here. You're actually rescuing penguins instead of, um, not those little penguins, proper, like, big size penguins. But you're rescuing penguins instead of elves because it was a marketing scheme uh, from the penguin bar from McVitie's, which I literally learned about 10 seconds ago, and it blew my mind. It was incredible. But, um, but yeah, so here you go. So essentially what you've got to do is save all the penguins, beat the bosses, and he's basically turned all the toys in the factory, Dr. Maybe, into evil things. So, like, you know, you've got these weird deck of card birds. And this game is just very bizarre. I, I think I had nightmares from this game, but I also loved it equally. Because you've got all those bears across the background that look sort of sad and then happy. And then you've got big balls of fluff that you're going across. Ow! Bloody hell. And what is he? <laughs> what is he? I don't even know what he is. What toy does he represent? This is bizarre. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's a train. There you go. Booyah! And apparently a, cha a train dropped teeth. This is very strange, this game. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna grab some of those. 600 points. 1,000 points! Now, how do I get up there? Is there... Hold on, if I try... Oh, wait, hold on. I'll have to hover. Uh... Oh, no. Come on, come on. Uh... Ye oh, just about made it. Right, if I drop down onto him. There you go. 10,000 points! Or was that 100k? No, it's 10k. Right, cool. So the end of the level is just this. So usually most of the levels you have to save all of the penguins or elves, whichever game you had. Um, and then once you actually have them, you can go to the end point and you finish the level. You probably noticed a second ago, I don't know if I ever mentioned it. I went into the first level and finished it straight off the bat. That was one thing that I learned as a kid. If you go to the left at the start as opposed to travelling to the right, um, then you actually finish the level. And this is another one of those games as well that didn't just constantly travel to the right. This one goes up, down, left, right, you go all over. But generally the progression does, does go to the right. And uh, yeah, this game just gets weirder and weirder and weirder. Like collecting rainbows, of course. I mean, I hope there's double rainbows in this. Although that, you know, meme wasn't viral back then, early 90s. Did the internet even exist in the Well, I know it existed, but I mean like, you know, common use of internet like we have today. I don't think it was. Oh, I just made that. Can I get up to the top of there? No, I can't. All right, okay. Let's carry on going down here. Oh, oh, still, oh, this is the Bassett's man. <laughs> What's the licorice man doing in this game? I bet you that was advertising as well. I'm going to notice all these little things now that I didn't notice as a kid. All these little, like, sneaky adverts. And it's going to just ruin my childhood doing a memory lane on this game. Oh, ah, ow. Get. Oh, no, let's go back up. I'm not going to let you take me down. That's it. Down you go. Oh, you can actually stand on the, the hippo. Of course. How did I not guess that? <laughs> this is such a strange game. There's snakes. 
like, ah, uh, I don't know. I don't even know how to explain this game. But this was definitely one that I played the most. Um, I don't think I've ever completed this game. I don't think I can go out there and say that I've completed it because I don't remember finishing it. At least not officially. Like, you know, I might have done it with a cheat on. But uh, I don't think I've ever done it legit. So we'll see how far we get today. I think I'm going to basically play today either until, one, I get bored. Two, I die of boredom from the adverts. Or three, um, I actually just die in general. So, or if I just get bored. Something like that. We'll work out a method of deciding. There you go. Sneak attack. Yes. There we go. But yeah, the levels change. And at one point, you become a car, I think. And at one point as well, you become a plane as well. It's a very, very peculiar game. Oh, oh for God's sake. There you go. Bloody snakes. Slivering. Oh, that's that one. Let's just try and get to the end. I want to try and show you as many of the levels as possible. I'm not bothered about collecting uh, every piece of... Every piece of whatever there is around. Like, you know, like these little stars here. I'll just... I'll grab them if they're in my path, but... I'm not going to stress too much. We're going to try and speed run this. Whoa! Kool-Aid, man. <laughs> he looks like de icer that you put on your car. There you go. Does anyone know what toy that is? I'm doing this on the live stream, by the way. It's the first time I recorded Memory Lane in front of everybody. If anybody knows what toy that is, because I'm absolutely clueless. Because, I mean, I suppose the deck of cards, you don't see them as birds, so it could literally be anything. Ah! Fuck at me. All right, let's keep going. I've still got five lives. Whoa, bullet bill. Ah! Ow! Oh, God. There we go. Ah! <laughs> Take that one. Whoa, a t-shirt. There you go. Oh, another t-shirt. Oh, I missed a pot of gold. Bloody hell. Right, hold up. Really? You want me to collect a glass of wine? This was supposed to be a, p a kid's game. Right, okay. I mean, I suppose back then people weren't as strict about what you could show on TV. Oh, I must get headshot there. Oh, the end. Oh, so it's not the end of the whole level. It's just the end of the area, but then we do that. <gasps> there we go. Oh, yeah. James Cod is going to rescue the world. One room at a time. Now, I think, now that I've got a little James Cod icon above the door, that is those two rooms done. And I think it's two rooms per boss. What the hell is that? Uh, oh, wait, wait. If I do this. Anything there? There's nothing there. What? Hold on a minute. Hold on. Let me try and get up to it. Uh, oh, oh. <gasps> Angel wings. Oh, my God, yes. Yes. I can fly. Oh, my God. I completely forgot about these. <laughs> oh, God. They don't even look like wings, though. They look like the hair from the Mad Doctor, you know, in Mega Man. Oh, my God. Yes! I can fly! Ba -da 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 -da. God, this game is ridiculous. I should show you the climbing down the stairs as well. You ready for this? Speed run. Oh, no. Oh, I'm flying, so I can't do it. Bugging me. Right, hold on. I've not unlocked that level yet. That's, that's tier two. So that one is... Oh, I thought that would be open now. Oh, my God. I'm further up than I thought. There you go. Oh, this is awesome. Right, so I've got those two. So why is that door still locked? Oh, it's not. It just opened as I walked over it. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, uh, oh, ow! Bloody hell, I remember this one now. So he tries to jump on you. Yeah? Oh, and you have to jump on his noggin. What? I thought you jumped on his head. Is that not how you do this, boss? Uh, there you go. One, two. No, okay, it's just that one. Okay, I am doing it right. Go on. Big teddy bear of doom. Uh, got you. Oh, no, middle. Ow. Oh, God, he packs a punch. There you go. You as well. Down you go, son. You're done. I don't think I can get him when he does that middle one. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. Bang. Gotcha. And up again. Oh, he's going a bit cross-eyed. Is that a good sign or is it a bad sign? He might start going crazy in a second and just like absolutely annihilate me in one hit. Yes. Teddy bear down, son. You're done. Look at that. Do I get no points for that? 1,700. Alright, good. Now, is my score 2,431? Is that is there like a missing decimal point there? I'm not sure. Did I say decimal or decimal? I don't remember what I just said there. <laughs> it came out... Right, here we... Oh, cake land. Look! Penguin bars! It is an advert! I feel like I should just show you everything. Get Diet Coke. Get yourself an iPhone. Panasonic? Yes, please. How about a new Nintendo 3DS? No, that's Justin Bieber's turf, isn't it? Did you see how many um, bloody... What's it called? Nintendo 3DS is Justin Bieber piled into his shopping cart in that um, 
redo of, what's it called, All I Want For Christmas Is You with Mariah Carey. It was the most obvious advert ever. It was disgusting. Ooh, Bassett's man! God's sake, Barry! Right, here we go. There you go. Oh, no, it's Bertie, isn't it? Barry? What? No, it's Bertie Bassett's. I remember now. Oh, oh, that's kind of interesting. I assume that would be a straight plane, but look, the spoon actually dips in. Nice little attention to detail. You don't really see much in the way of curves inside of, um, inside of Sega Genesis games. It's usually quite flat surfaces, or at least the surfaces that you walk on. You see curved graphics, but not so much. What? Oh, bloody hell. Hold on. Coke and wine. Not a good mix. I wouldn't recommend drinking those two together, by the way. Just saying. Bye! Oh, Bertie! This, this is going to be the shortest LP of this game ever. Oh. Right, let's speed run this. I don't care. It's always Bertie, man. He always gets me. I'm not going to fall for it. No, I fell for it again. Said I wasn't. Did straight away. Let me see where he's... There we go. Come here, Bertie. What? Has he got some kind of, like, toxic icing on his noggin? Oh, my God. Does not look happy in the bottom right corner? Oh. Oh. There we go. Not doing a very good job of this. Uh, no. Oh, for... Run. I forgot how terrible I am at games. No, no. Oh, there's a plate up there. Birds, though. Oh, God. There you go. Get some fruit. Get some cake. Oh, what? What? How are you supposed to... Oh, I can't walk across there. <laughs> I can't do it. There's cheese. There was a star. Never mind. Keep an eye out for Bertie, though. Oh, penguins. There you go. Rescuing the penguins. Mm. Right, let's go. Oh, there was a secret ending up there. I probably could have completed the level if I'd gone up there. Book of me. Oh, I... No, Kool Aid Man. Back off, bro. Here we go. What's with the eyes in the wall? That's not worrying at all, is it? Uh, here we go. There you are. Right. Where are we off to? Oh, oh for God's sake, Bertie! You've made me lose the game. This is so. Sh I'm playing it again. Con yes, I'll get a continue. God's sake, Bertie. Right. Oh, my God. I suck at games. One minute I can stand on top of his head, and the next minute I can't. There we go. Go! I didn't even see him there. Right, icing. Oh, I can drop into the icing. No, 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 no. Oh my God, what is going on here? I've only got a certain amount of breath. Hold on a minute. <laughs> of course, I'm, a, I'm like a fish. I'm a tadpole, aren't I? So I can do this. I can swim on the water. Whoa, whoa. No, 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 no. Oh, we're back again. Right. I you get the ice in. Because the ice is definitely uh, see-through and watery, like. <laughs> oh, God. I know. I'm sorry, James. I'm making you like a fool here. How the... How are you even supposed to... I don't remember dying nearly this much as a kid. It's just a dead end. What was the point in that? Right. So where are we going to? For God's sake. Bertie, don't you dare! it? No, I know your game. Wait, do I have to take Bertie out to go up there? I think I do. Uh, uh. Alright, up you go, James. Yes, there you are. Get yourself a heart, a kettle, some armour. Whoa, invincibility, right. Where's Bertie at? I'll kick his ass, I just killed him, bugger. That's it, down you go. You're done, son. Where are all of you at? i tell you what, I think I need to go up there, so... I may as well stand here and do my teleportation. Well, I say teleportation, stretching. There you go. Oh my god, apples, good. Whatever else is here. Are they chocolate walls? Oh, I can walk past them, sorry. That's the thing, sometimes I can't tell if I can. Okay, yeah! Suck that one, Bertie! Yeah! Bertie dead! Another one, what's that? Free Bertie. Oh, now I've run out. Now I'm not so brave anymore. <laughs> I'll just, I'll go over him. It's fine. There's two birdies. Wine, umbrella, cherry, ice cream, apple. I'm trying to, like, see what they are before I get it. Oh, my, oh, forgot about the umbrella. If you jump from a high distance in some levels, you get that. Oh, wait. Oh, do I only get to use it the once? Ah, oh, rubbish. Penguin bars. It's barely subliminal, is it? Look at me. I'm inside, I'm inside of an aero bar now. I don't even know if they have, ouch. I don't even know if they have aero bars in, uh, in places other than the UK. What's that on? Are they eyes? I don't like that. There's eyes everywhere. It's really freaky. Oh. Oh, moving chocolate. Here we go. I'm surprised this doesn't have the word Cadbury's, like, branded on it or Hershey's or something like that. Here we go. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Where's Bertie at? I don't trust him. Screw you, Bertie! Oh, no! Careful, go! Okay, we're good. Oh, brilliant. You found a secret penguin bar. Really? It's a secret? Oh, for God's sake. Uh, there you go, I'm up. Oh, God, I'm really bad at this game. I like when he runs as well. He gets, like, spinny feet like Sonic does. Well, I say feet, fins. And he has a gun on the cover. Can you see the thing just below me? He's got a gun. When do I get a gun? I don't ever remember getting a gun. I get the cool vehicles. Well, that's about it. And you get the big explosions, I guess, with the bosses. But that's that's the only thing I see in the way of sort of a James Bond reference. There we go. Uh, across you go. Beautiful stuff. Right, now what is up here? Oh, hold on a minute. Oh, I see. There's a platform there. I was just going to roll down that little ledge, but... Chances are that probably leads to spikes, so not recommended. Whoa! <gasps> What's that? Oh, can I ride that up? <gasps> oh, this is just like Battlefield. <laughs> Have you seen it in Battlefield when you do that with the robot, like the little drone? And it like, takes them all the way to the top of the level. Here we go. What's up here? Oh, it's getting a bit claustrophobic now. Oh, bloody hell. Whoa! Steady on. Snake. Ah, no. My ninja reflex is there. Oh, of course there's another bloody penguin bar. I think somebody should go back in this video and count how many penguin bars there are. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, thank you, penguin. I love you. Damn it, it's working. They're getting to me. This isn't right. This is not right. I have no idea where I'm going right now. I feel like I'm going backwards. But at the same time, I don't. Oh, God. Keep going. I only have one little thing left on that life. So I've got to be careful. Oh, really? Oh, oh, they're there. Okay. I thought they were going to be, like, hovering over, over spikes. Right, here we go. Come on, James. Let's do this. Oh, God, now I'm going diagonally. Jesus Christ. This is ridiculous. Oh. Uh, oh, oh, a brolly. Good. That's exactly what I needed. In case I fall, it should save me. There you go. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't think the wall of candy cane is helping me relax either. It's just sort of strobing my eyes out. It's distracting me a little bit. Oh, oh we're back from where we came from. Yeah, we are. Ah, oh, right, okay. Let's head back now. So that was only semi-pointless. Only a little bit. There you go. Get your speedy legs on. There you go, James. See, the thing is, is that I don't think you take full damage, so I don't understand what the umbrella's all about. Maybe you use it to get to particular platforms, though, later on in the game. Ah, uh, careful. This first part always looks the same, doesn't it? Am I going around in the circle? I think I'm going around in the circle. I genuinely think I'm going around in the circle. Hmm. Maybe it's... Maybe it's those things at the bottom of the hill that you have to avoid. No, see, I haven't been there yet. Oh! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Get on top of it. Get chocolate. Oh, Jesus. There we go. Oh. Uh, there we go. Right, I tell you what, I'm going to run down this hill. And I'm going to jump at the bottom. But I feel like a... Maybe up one of these raised platforms, there's there's an exit. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm lost. I am completely... What about if I go down there? What's down here? <gasps> Is that the end? Is that the actual end? No, it's not. Oh my god. Oh Jesus, this is Bertie's domain, isn't it? Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god, I missed it. Right, try again. Ice and slippery, don't judge me. Uh, there we go. Screw you, Bertie. I know you're around here somewhere. Oh god. The precision you have to have to play this game is unreal. Stand on the clam. Oh no, no! Oh, come on. Uh, uh. Is there anything up there? No. Oh god. Uh. Oh, God. Can I climb up anywhere? Can I? Oh, I nearly did. Oh, okay. Uh, oh. Oh, God. Oh, got it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 no, no. Oh, come on. Oh, Jesus. Okay. You have got to be having a giraffe. This is God awful. Hold on a minute. <laughs> there is no way. I am going to complete this game in this one sitting. Jeez. Oh, oh. Let's try again. And up we go. On the deck of cards. Suck a wet one, my friend. And we continue onward. There we go. All right. Get the, the little icing drop. 
It's about to call it a gum drop then. You. Oh. I was going to get so angry. Come on. <laughs> I'm getting angry at a Sega Genesis game made for kids. That's my ah rage level right now. Oh, a Lady Gaga teacup. There you go. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, come on, man. Oh. I hate this game. I hate this game so much. Why did I even bother choosing this for today? <laughs> it's because it's weird. That's why I chose it, but still. Right, let's try again. On to the icing. Up to there. Oh god, there you go. Take our time. One at a time. Uh. Oh, you are joking. That thing is so small to try and land on. Right. Up. Up. You can do this, James. I believe in you. We chose you to work for the government for a reason. Go. 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 Right, I tell you what, before I try anything else, I'm going to try and climb up another one. Uh, oh my god, how long does this level go on for? You have got to be kidding me. I'm on it. Yes. Got it. Oh god, where's the deck of cards, bird? Oh god. Oh god. Uh, yeah, because points is definitely... Uh, yes. I want to take him out before I continue. There you go. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, that's close. Sorry, I'm not saying much right now because I'm scared up my mind. Oh, Jesus. There you go. Oh, God, no. Oh, as if. This is worse than when I had to jump between the chocolate platforms. Oh, oh, no! Oh, you are having a bubble. I'm back at the start again. No! This game is difficult, man. Tell you what, if anybody wants to play an old Genesis game and they want a challenge, get this. Oh my god. This is... I don't remember this being so difficult. I remember breezing for at least the first three bosses and levels. Oh my god. Maybe I always just did the first ones with like... No, because even if I had cheats on, I'm invincible, but I still fall really far. Right. Oh my god. Here we go. Screw you, Umbrella. Don't need you. Okay. Ah! Uh, that's it. God, I hate those deck of card birds. Really, you want me to land on that? Go! Oh! Oh! Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. There you go! Oh. Go! Go! No! <laughs> Why? Why? Wait, when did I end up up here? Oh. I closed my eyes for like two seconds and suddenly I'm halfway across the level. Right. Right. Let's try again. No, someone's calling me. I can't call right now. I'm climbing on icing. Uh, there we go. Keep it coming. There we are. Right. If I do this, I'm going to be so happy. That's the one thing about the old Genesis games is that one, there was no saving. And two, if there was a difficult part... Then, when you completed it, you just felt such, like, liberation and, like, you know, just such pride in being able to do it. Okay. Let's take our time. Land on that drop. There you go. Uh, oh, God. Okay. Okay. Uh, right. Let's just spec this out. And go! Yes! Oh, thank God a checkpoint. I didn't even know they existed, but I'm so glad they do. Ooh. Okay, this is incredible. This is good. I'm so... Oh, bugger me. Of course, there's more bloody birds up there. Oh, I say birds. Right. The hell? Hello? Who are you? Ah. Oh. oh, I shouldn't really jump off that edge. I don't know what's down there. Uh. Uh, no, that's a bad idea. That's a really bad idea. So, essentially, I've got to go up the middle. Nah, it's not going to happen. <laughs> Rejected. There you go. Right, now if I do that... Uh, oh, I tried to jump up there and across. Actually, I think that's the only one that comes up over the middle. So I should be alright. Except if that bugger up there gets me. Oh, come on. Oh, what? How in... Hold on, let me go down here. There might be something down here that I can use. Oh, thank God, wings. There's two wings. Oh. <gasps> Double wing! Oh, yeah. Alright, we got it. We got this. Whoa, whoa. Careful. 
There you go. I shouldn't have really grabbed those second ones in case these ones fail. I think that was just pure luck, though. There we go. I'm like a bird. Right, let me just get out of this god-awful level. I hate this. I dread to think what the boss is going to be. I only have one life left, though, and three hits. So, I don't. I know I have one more continue as well. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, Jesus. Where do I go? Where's the way out? <laughs> where, do, where, where do I go? Which? Oh, okay, got it. Uh, oh, yeah, navigating this like a... Balls. It's a flying fish. There we go. Right, let's try again. No! No! I'm not doing it again. I'm not doing it again. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. There is no way. That should have taken me back to my checkpoint. So, I tell you what. Thank you very much for watching for today. That is Memory Lane for this week. James Pond 2 Robocod on the Sega Mega Drive slash Genesis. Um, if you want to go check it out, it's awesome. There'll be some links in the description where you can play it. Because I think ROMs are okay nowadays, it's, it's, it, particularly for the older consoles. If they're not available on, say, you know, the Wii Retro Marketplace, Xbox Live Arcade, stuff like that, then I don't know. I don't think ROMs are such a bad thing if they're not available to purchase anymore. But anyway, I am going to go now, and I shall see you all in a little bit. Bye! Screw you, James.